Hi, Perpetual Mommy here today to do a Target haul for all of you. I'm coming to you very late Saturday night. Thought I would go ahead and share with all of you what we did purchase at Target this evening. And I want to preface this video by saying, you guys, that I am venturing into kind of drugstore hair and makeup products. I really enjoy high-end stuff, but I don't enjoy the high-end price tag. So I have been watching a lot of haul videos lately and everybody talks about this, you guys. I have been hearing about this Aussie three minute miracle moist um, stuff. I don't even know. I can't even tell you how many hauls and reviews I've watched where people just rave about this. So, you know, I'm gonna not buy my super expensive hair mask and we're gonna go ahead and try this. I think this giant bottle, you guys, was like $5.99. So again, I love my high-end stuff, but I don't love the high-end price tag. And if this does anywhere near as good a job as people are raving about, man, I'm super excited about that $5.99. So that's the first thing I bought today. And along that same line, you guys, I bought an e.l.f. primer. And I'm gonna show you guys, this is my favorite primer by Hourglass. And it is like a $60 primer. You see the 45 or $60 for a full size. And this little one here, this little teeny thing is $18. And so a bunch of people have been talking about the e.l.f. brand and I don't even know, this was like $5, you guys. It's, look at the, the ounces, I mean, this is, I don't even know, 0.47 fluid ounces. And this one is, I don't even know, you guys, nothing. It's like hardly anything. But anyways, I thought, you know what, this doesn't have SPF in it, but while I'm home, if I'm not going out during the day and I just want something to put on under my makeup, why am I spending my, why am I using my really expensive one with the SPF in it if I can be using, you know, like a drugstore kind of brand that works good? So we're going to give this one a go, you guys. So I'm excited about that. There was a bunch of different ones that they had, so I didn't know which one to buy, so we'll see how that one works out. And then I got a, a new baby hair conditioner for the girls, and this is in the sweet orange. I think that's what they call it, sweet orange vanilla scent. And I don't even know what happened, you guys. We bought one for the babies like a month ago, barely used it, and it is gone, like disappeared. We went to bathe the babies a few days ago, and it was just like straight up gone, out of the bathroom, and nobody goes in there except my 23-year-old. So it is very possible that my adult daughter has run off with the baby conditioner. So we got a new one of those. And oh, if you guys can relate to this, do you see this box? That's because I let my three-year-old hold this while we were shopping and while we were looking at baby clothes or toddler clothes, my daughter, uh, yeah, she personalized the box for us. But um, this is a Pacifica, this is the face sunscreen. And so I wanted to go ahead and try this one just because it's so hard to put sunscreen on the girls' faces when we're out and about. So I wanted to go ahead and try this. It's a more natural one, just uses zinc oxide. So we'll see how it goes. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and give that one a try. All right, and then the next two things are just little things that my husband picked up. He wanted to try that razor because he'd heard about it, and he needed a new set of toenail clippers because, again, our children, my 13-year-old son, ran off with my husband's toenail clippers, and we have no idea where they went. All right, and then we're going to move on to some, like, educational stuff that we got. I stopped at the dollar spot. You guys know I love the dollar spot at Target, and I thought these would be good for the diaper bag just to keep for when we're out. We get stuck somewhere. We can work on these together. So I got a number card and an alphabet card. Now, we do have a better set for home, like a higher-end set that we can use at home, but I thought these would be really good for the diaper bag. And um, we did get a new set of twistable crowns, and, you know, the box, again, has been personalized by the children already. So just another set of those. Oh my gosh, you guys. Again, in the dollar spot, so excited about these. So these were a dollar and the same or different workbook. I thought the three-year-old would really like this. This is right up her alley, right where she's at right now. Um, and then they had these white clean books. Now, obviously this one's like way too advanced. It's a cursive. And then um, they had an addition one. And this one's a little bit advanced too, but we can do number recognition with this one and some tracing. Now these are wipeable, you guys. So they're like whiteboard wipeable. So I thought we, again, we could do some number recognition with these. But this is the one, and they only had one. I literally, you guys, for like five minutes, dug through every single one that they had like eight times. My husband thought I was insane. I was like on the floor looking through all of them. This was the only one they had in printing practice. And it is printing practice. I wanted one for both babies. I desperately wanted two of these. And this was the only one I could find, but it's wipeable. And I just thought, wow, this is so great um, for the girls to practice because the three-year-old's really getting ready to um, really want to try writing. So I was just super excited with these finds. But man, you guys, if you can come across this printing practice, like I said, I dug through all of, uh, there were hundreds of books and that was the only printing practice that I found. 
And the other educational thing that I was super excited about, you guys, is this clock. And I was excited about this clock for two reasons. One is it's got nice big hands, which I liked. The other thing I liked about it is that the numbers aren't pre-written in here. So not only can we do time, like start doing time, telling time with a handed clock, but we can do number practice with the three-year-old practicing writing her numbers in the clock as well. So that was just kind of a dual win for us. And this was all of $3, you guys. Super excited about this. I'm sorry, I've kind of got a mess going on over here. All right, and then we got a package of um, the Honest Company training pants. So the three-year-old is potty trained. The one-year-old, for those of you who watch my, my videos and my vlogs, the one-year-old decided about two weeks ago to self-potty train herself. So she pretty much has mastered pee in the potty. She has not mastered the poop in the potty. So she does need to wear training pants and I love Parasol products, you guys, but they don't make training pants. So um, besides Parasol, Honest Company is my favorite brand. So we are really liking the um, Honest Company training pants. I'm going to put these over here. Let me go ahead and move this down. All right, and then you guys, you know me. I cannot go to Target without looking at the clearance section for clothes because I love the Cat and Jack stuff. And look at this, you guys. So again, I have a one-year-old and a three-year-old, both little girls. And the one-year-old wears anywhere between a 3T a two, well, usually a 3T and a 4T in the Cat and Jack stuff, and the three-year-old wears a 4T or a 5T, so I thought these were really cute together. And then, you guys, look at these little shorts. <laughs> now, she normally wears a bigger size than this. This is for, actually, my three-year-old, but these shorts look really big for a 3T, so I got these for the three-year-old. And then this little flowy shirt. I just thought that was really cute. And then for the one-year-old, she got a little pair of shorts. They hardly had any 2T shorts, so my pickings were very slim for the one-year-old, but I got this little pink shirt to go with those shorts. So we're working on uh, filling up our summer wardrobe because the girls have a bunch of clothes for cold weather, but nothing really for hot weather. And you guys, it's been like 100 plus degrees here lately. And then um, this is for the one-year-old. I thought this was really cute. Now it's past the 4th of July. But my husband's like, you know, you can be patriotic all year long. So I went ahead and picked these up. And this one is for the three-year-old. So those are really cute clothing finds today. So you guys, check out your Target clearance section for kids' clothes because they have some great stuff, you guys. All right, and then the last clothing item that is not very exciting but super functional is my 13-year-old said, Mom, I need some tall socks for my boots. So he has some... Um, significant like hiking boots that he likes to wear so he needed some big socks for those and then the last things we last three things I have are food items so you guys know me I cannot go to Target without getting a package of the yogurt bites the yogurt chips that my little girls love and then we never eat junk food you guys like it just does not happen in our house we don't buy junk food but I saw these we bought some junk food because I love puffs I love white cheddar and I love jalapeno. So these may be dangerous. They may be a one time only because I'm gonna eat too many and not feel good and never buy them again, but they look super exciting. So we bought some junk food. And then the very last thing we purchased, which is not very exciting at all, you guys, is a box of Cheerios, which is a staple at our house. We realized this morning that we were basically out of Cheerios. Okay, you guys, so that's it for this current Target haul, but I have to show you something that I actually bought about three weeks ago, so right before my last Target haul, and it is seriously probably my favorite Target find that I have bought in like six months. Now, for those of you who don't know, I am a cup, W-H-O-R-E, like seriously, coffee cup and mugs. My husband's shaking his head at me Honestly. because... He wants me to use the word connoisseur. I am a cup connoisseur. It's about how it feels in my hand. It's about the weight. It's how long it keeps my drinks cold or hot because if I'm drinking coffee, I want it scalding hot. Devil wears Prada hot. If I'm drinking water or iced tea, I want it cold as can be. Like I do not do lukewarm, room temperature, anything, whether it's coffee, whether it's water. I just, I don't. Iced coffee has to be super iced. Anyways, I digress. So I love my, I love, 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 love my swell bottles. Okay, you guys, those are $45 a pop. They're crazy. I love them, but I don't like that. I have to unscrew the cap all the time. I've got to buy a separate top to be able to like pop it open. So I was at Target and I saw these and first of all, the color is just gorgeous. And I was like, I told my husband, I'm like, I, I need that cup. He's like, dude, you don't need another cup. I'm like, no, really? I need another cup. Um, and it was on sale. So I think it normally was like $16.99 and it was on sale for like 12 bucks. So we got it. And you guys like, do you hear the ice in here? 
that's from last night. Uh, it keeps my drinks so cold. This is 26 ounces, so I can drink a couple of these a day usually, but I obviously didn't do that recently. But one of my favorite features about this cup, you guys, obviously is it's got this nice clear top, which is really pretty. But I was so excited when I, didn't even know this when I bought it, but I like to make sure that I can wash everything right away and get everything clean. And you guys, if you squeeze this in the middle, this whole top pops off so you can make sure that you wash every part of your cup because I can't tell you how many cups I've had was kind of like slidey thing or the rims get really gross and you can't wash them you can wash all these pieces you guys and again this is 26 ounces so it has a great weight it has a great feel when you drink out of it it's I don't know if you guys can see it's kind of like lipped it's just super sturdy I love it and it's my bevy is what's called and you can buy this on mybevy.com but again I got this at Target so if you guys check out your Target see if it's on sale there because I highly, highly, highly recommend it. Again, I love my swell bottles, but man, for 12 bucks, I'm all over this. So that is it for me, you guys. That's our Target haul. Hopefully you all had a great Saturday. I look forward to seeing you in the next haul video. If you're new, welcome. And if you haven't subscribed already, I'd love it if you'd hit that subscribe button. I'll talk to you all soon. Bye-bye.